their decisions. Antonis Samaras speaking in the last few minutes. Official projections suggest Alexis Tsipras's party has won, but it's unclear whether it secured an overall majority. It could have wide-ranging implications for Europe, as Mr Tsipras has pledged to renegotiate debt repayments and plans to spend billions of euros on welfare. At least 15 people have been killed in Cairo in clashes between police and demonstrators. The anti-government protests were staged to mark the fourth anniversary of Egypt's uprising. Today's clashes follow the death of an activist in a march yesterday. Severe weather warnings are in place this week as heavy snow is expected. The Met Office says Northern England, Scotland and Northern Ireland could all be affected from Wednesday afternoon. Sports and Andy Murray has made it through to the quarterfinals of the Australian Open tennis, beating Grigor Dimitrov in a tough four-set contest. Me and Grigor played a, a pretty high-level match and I needed to play very good tennis to, to win tonight, but that isn't always the case. I could play badly in a couple of days and still maybe try and find a way to get through or in the FA Cup, unlike yesterday, the Premier League teams have avoided any shocks today. Holders Arsenal won 3-2 at Brighton, while Aston Villa were 2-1 winners over Bournemouth. And West Ham triumphed 1-0 away at Bristol City. The draw for the fifth round will be tomorrow evening. That's the latest. I'm Andy Hayes. Remaining mild but cloudy and breezy this evening with patchy rain in places. Isolated wintry showers are possible and tonight's lows of two degrees. Campus FM weather. With SBS Bathroom Centre, the home of Supreme Bathrooms and Showers, Albert Street West, Grimsby. Creating the bathroom of your dreams.